So starting by the front door, I have this chest of drawers and in the top is hats, scarves and gloves and mitts and things like that. And then in the other two drawers is shoes and boots and things like that. And then I've got this dish for keys. That's my pot for my keys, my sunglasses. That's a little light up moomin, a little plant. And then that's a coaster that normally lives on my table over here. So this is one of my poem chairs with a poem footstool and this is a table that I move around. This is a placemat that a friend, my friend Dan Harrod made for me. So that's my placemat and coaster. So that's for when I have my meals. And I've just got my juice bottle on there at the moment. So that just, so when it's not in use, I have it as like a side table to my chair. And then when I'm eating, I move it round. And then just by the front door, I just keep my wheelchair there. Then I've got my rainbow coat hook. So I've got my coats there with my Fora bags. Then that's my hoover and I have my lovely button rug that I absolutely love. And then I've just got that unit over there that's just got some random bits and bobs inside and my very tiny television. I don't watch much television so I'm not really bothered about having a massive television. And then I've got some shelves with sentimental things on. The bunting my friend Becca made for me and Becca also made that quote for me. She hand lettered it as a housewarming gift. And then I've got my other rocking Pawang chair. I am going to change the cover on it so I won't have the leaves. I'm going to get a plain yellow one. And then that's my craft corner which I've done a tour video of so I'll link that in the corner and in the description box. One thing that I forgot to put on the tour video is that lovely sloth coaster that my friend Jennifer got me as a housewarming gift. I love filling my home with gifts that friends have got me. It just makes my house a lot more special. I've got a plant that's a bit poorly at the moment, so giving that a bit of TLC. And that zebra painting was by my friend Steffi and on um, my windowsill I've got that ceramic jug that I made and then I've got some plants that are doing really well so I've got my oxalis over there that's in a lovely turquoise zebra pot that goes with the theme of this room which is turquoise and then I've got a lovely picture that my friend Katie made for me. And that elephant is actually my watering can. I absolutely love it. And that peace lily was my granddad's. So that's lovely to have here. So... And then that's my kitchen area. And I absolutely love this vinyl flooring. So that's the fridge. 
So I bought some magnetic tape and basically turned my fridge into a organiser. So that's really helpful. And then I've got my recycling bin that I decorated with my Cricut. So when I was house hunting, I saw that kettle and toaster set and I fell in love with it and I didn't want it to go. So I bought it and that became the theme for my kitchen and then because I have an integrated kitchen and living room I had to tie the theme in in my front room so I had to get a turquoise wall in the front room so I went for optimistic outlook which is the paint colour for those two walls so I've just got some decorations there so because there's not many kitchen cupboards i've just got those two cupboards up there and that cupboard down there and those drawers i didn't have much storage space so diane my pa found this external unit it's giving me extra storage space for food as well as other bits and bobs like I've got my microwave on there so up on these shelves I wanted to get some kiln jars for my tea coffee and sugar and then I spotted these turquoise ones so I was able to get some turquoise kilner jars, which was absolutely perfect. So I've got them for my tea, coffee and sugar. And I've had that absolutely years. I've got it as a freebie with my Yorkshire tea. So I keep my Yorkshire tea in there and then I keep tea bag packets in there. And then my cafeteria and infuser teapots up there. And then just other bits. And then matching to my kettle and toaster is the mug tree and kitchen roll holder. And then I found this turquoise dish rack in the range. And then I've just got like an organiser here and just some bits. So... Um, so I have my kettle, but then I have a hot water dispenser as well because I can't use kettles. And then that's a gift my friend Alice got me and I just use it to put spoons and tea bags on. So that's the kitchen area. And then this is my bedroom. And then at the end of my bed, I put this banner which a pen pal made and sent me so I just thought this was a really cute place to put it and then that's my makeup table which is something that I've always wanted so I've got my perfume and glow mist there and my makeup mirror there that lights up and then i've decorated with my cricut the drawers on my makeup organizer and then i've also decorated the makeup brushes pot and then there's a drawer underneath that has other makeup bits that i don't use so often and then there's just some other bits and bobs like I've got like a stationary drawer in there and some colouring bits and just random bits and bobs. Um, and then that's my mail inbox and outbox. And then that's my Dyson fan. So that's Polly who I've had from my first Christmas so she'll be nearly 30 years old and 
that's a coaster made by a friend and the same friend made that coaster which I absolutely love and then just some bits on my windowsill and then those are the wardrobes that I already had back at my dad and stepmom's and the butterflies are origami butterflies that I've just decorated and that is my Christmas tree for my first Christmas in my new home and then that's my bookcase over there. This is a closer look at my bookshelf so I've got colouring books and just not reading books basically at the top and my embroidered hoop and put fairy lights around here these are some of my reading books my friend Steffi made the origami zebra for me this bear was knitted for me by Amy who lives in the USA she has severe ME herself and knits bears for people with ME all around the world which is really lovely of her and she does it just to occupy herself but also just to cheer up the lives of other people with ME and Harrod who made that placemat also made this zebra for me and then I've got some more books down here and then a cross stitch that I did and then my aromatherapy diffuser and my aromatherapy oils are in there and just some bits and bobs so that's my bookshelf Oh, and the name of my bear is called Willow. It just looks really nice having the fairy lights around my bookshelf. And then I've just got my wheat heaty there and my zebra wheat heaty and my pyjama case there. And that's my iPad beanie. And then that's my iPad in its iPad case and I have a light attached to my overbed table and this table tilts so if I want to do crafting I can tilt this table so that was quite a good investment and something that I really wanted so when I moved here I bought this table to go in my new home and this bedding that I've got on is one of my favourite bedding I think I love all my bedding sets but I like this one because it's just lovely and soft because it's quite well worn but my new Disney bedding set I absolutely love so I'll post a picture of that on my Instagram. And then this is my bathroom. So I've got my Disney towels out at the moment. This is probably my favourite towel set. So I've got a matching bath mat. So... And this, so I really wanted a light up mirror cabinet, but they were also expensive. And then I spotted online on the range this one for less than a hundred pound. So it lights up and then it dims as well. There we go, so it dims and then brightens and then turns off and then I've got these little pots to organise 
all my toiletries. And then I've got this really cute soap dispenser. So it's kind of sparkly. Whoops. So it's kind of sparkly with these little tiny ducks inside. And then I've got this polka dot toothbrush and soap dispenser set. And then I've got this other giant cabinet. And then like the theme for in here is diamante stuff. So I've got some diamante handles and then I've got a diamante toilet roll holder and the toilet roll holder here is diamante as well and I've got a sparkly toilet seat as well so that's my bathroom